So, I said it before with the Empire images, they were bound to release some of what they had shown at CinemaCon, and wow, boy did they. We have a brand new TV spot titled Greatest Depths. So I'm going to give you my breakdown and hopefully we can open a discussion on things that we missed, liked, or even disliked. So we opened with what is fast becoming a pretty iconic shot of the Covenant flying through space, Daniels again hammering home that they are all making history, the first to go this far into our galaxy. A beautiful brand new shot of the dropship landing over the lake area. The blend of practical and CG effects in this movie is looking better and better the more I see. We see the crew disembarking the dropship and then another brand new shot. Just a different angle, but it's nice to see the set that they built and the location itself looks stunning. We see the spore being broken and what looks like airborne accelerant coming together and binding to then fly into the host's ear. It's a shot we've seen a fair few times, the shot directly after of him falling over is something new. It looks like he's feeling the effects of having a neomorph growing inside of him. We were told initially that these things don't take long to gestate, so I'm hazarding a guess this is shortly after, not immediately, but not a lengthy time either. A great shot of Daniels and fellow crewmen beginning to look up at the crashed juggernaut. It's an absolutely beautiful shot here and really shows some of the magnitude of the story they appear to be telling. It's really grand, and massively large scale. The shower scene again, the callback to aliens, and we see the protomorph performing the head bites. We learned from the previous TV spots that the alien did indeed have the inner jaw, but it's nice to see it in action here, if only super quick. We flash to a scene of what I'm guessing is actually the dropship coming into the planet for the first time. We then see the shot of this externally and it looks like they are going through a lightning storm of some sort, so I think this just ties directly into that sequence. We see the quarantine Neomorph breaking loose, chasing, and then more than likely the scene previous to that as it erupts from the crewman's back and begins its killing spree. Now here things ramp up into the CinemaCon footage. We see David, yes, David, his head attached to his body and he is dropping the black goo canisters on the engineers below. One thing to note, it looks like the juggernaut he was piloting is in fact now docked the mother juggernaut we saw in the Empire magazine photos. We can see the structure jutting downwards to the left. So a question I wondered is, are the canisters on his ship or were they on the mother juggernaut? A lot of people have asked how is this David when he was just ahead. I did a video on this, but a quick summary, Shaw actually took his body with her in the last scenes of Prometheus. It's a stunning shot though, the canisters dropping, they look to be falling in an order or a sequence, and it does make me wonder if they are programmed to fall in such a way somehow. We then see the mask below, the engineers or humanoids, some appear to be almost vaporising, charring into the blackened corpses we see in the other trailers. It looks like they were all gathered in a courtyard type area, we can see the gate, the pillars surrounding them. The gate itself is closed and they are attempting to run past it. We then see the same area but after the massacre. The Covenant crew are among the corpses and the platform piloted by Tennessee is dropping in for perhaps a rescue. We get some shots we've seen before and close on the alien jumping at the screen once more. So just a quick apology guys, this is a little late. I just realised that these had been released and then I was trying to set up my new iMac so I could begin these videos for you all, so it took some time. It's a pretty insane TV spot. Have you guys seen it? If so, are there some things I've pointed out that maybe you missed? What were your favourite parts to it? I think a full trailer with the CinemaCon footage is imminent and I believe it may even drop on Alien Day. But as always, let me know what you think down below in the comment section. And if you did enjoy this video, then please consider leaving a like and subscribing to the channel for more in the future. If you think this video is worth it and you want to support the channel, then please head on over to my Patreon page. The link is in the description box. I've been Mr. H, and until next time, I'll catch you in the comment section.